just um, make this backyard toy a race car, just by putting uh, stickers on it. Okay, we'll be sweet sixteen. Not bad, not bad. Might be a little bit too old for that. <laughs> well, I better shut up now. And let me introduce you to Lexi, my wild Icelandic friend. I'm a motorsport fan. I'm a snowmobiler, I'm a racer. Lexi Games Racing Team competing in snowmobiling and winning a lot and uh, becoming Icelandic champion. I competed twice in X Games on snowmobiles and did a bit of racing on uh, motocross bikes, enduro bikes, uh, go-karts, rally, basically everything with an engine in it. Not just wheels, everything that has an engine. Yeah, yeah, it just runs on yeah, petrol. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard the legend, I don't know if it's true. Did you ever like do like a world record in like open water on a snowmobile? Yes, uh, yes I did. Take a look at this Ripley's World Exclusive. Alexander Karasin is a world champion snowmobile racer who's always ready to ride. Ripley's, believe it or not, they came here to Iceland and they wanted to do something cool. And I think it stands still basically there, but of course somebody else has to Wait, what to do you mean? Done. You have... I have a Ripley's, yeah. believe it or not, world record still. Okay. At least it's, it's, it's in the books. It's yeah. on the video at least. He has yeah. to sustain this high speed over open sea or he'll sink to the ocean floor. Slamming into shore, he's done it. So about two weeks ago, Lexi called me up and said, Frank, I'm going to drive the Iceland Hill Rally and I need you with me. And of course it's a yes. But it's the camera Maverick DS, so it's, it's a small one and it's the less powered one, but it's gonna be the most fun one, for sure. Because you're driving it. Because I'm driving it. You're gonna be the co-driver. But this is a, a fast machine and it has really good suspension. We're gonna put new tires on it. We're gonna put the seat belts in it. Fill up the gas tank and we should be ready to go. Nice. It's not complicated, it's only a rally, right? We're gonna be high speed, yeah. Yeah. On on really, really old Icelandic mountain roads. Gravel, a bit yeah. of rivers. 90 degree turns every once in a while. They are narrow. Okay. But we're going to be driving as fast as we can. Which and is... I know that we're going to be at least clocking around 130 to 140k. We're going to be in a, a fire retarded suit, your hands helmet. equipment, or, yeah. a helmet and everything. And uh, so you're going to be in race gear. And then we're going to have an exterior gear because we're in an open cage. Yeah. yeah. It's going to be a hell of a ride. Testing is going to be the first dates <laughs> of the race. I'm like, I'm curious. I'm curious. I'm yeah. nervous. Well, it's good. Um, it's good to be excited. nervous. Yeah. Resigned. Yeah, you're not nervous. No, no, no. Not for this. Well, you're driving. So that's. I'm driving. <laughs> I don't have any worrying to do. Exactly. You're the one that's sitting in the passenger seats. I know you're going to go through hell. Oh, God. <laughs> Am I scaring you now? It is race day. Uh, we are just in front of Lexi's welding shop. Uh, we're just doing the last preparations in the car. Last night the boys um, replaced the plastic skid plate in the back with an aluminium skid plate so we can hit the bumps a bit more without being too anxious about breaking shit. We had to manage to get the helmets hooked up to the audio system so we can actually hear each other when we're trying to navigate. We just the seat belts and all that kind of stuff. And um, yeah, pretty much ready for the rally. I'm pretty excited. Uh, we're just Q1 
counting down the hours. Six thirty five plus fifteen makes six fifty. That's when we start on the second stage, mm -hmm. which is like basically we do this thing, and from there we straight away go to the second stage. I tap this one every time we hit a marker. I, I tap it so it goes back to zero. Yeah. That's basically all I do, and I read the book. Okay, so in two kilometers and four hundred meters, jump, and then once we hit the jump. Zero. But there's not a lot because the third stage is like through like like this and there's not a lot of markers. There's basically like oh there's a cala grit, ignore the track, ignore the track. Rough going downhill, jump, cattle track, jump or twist. But I know the world and it goes like chush, 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 chush. and that's not in it. It would be nice to be fast, but not the fastest. Because then I wouldn't be scared. <laughs> Wait, where's Lexi? Let's go. How about that? Yeah? How about that? House. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Got speed. What speed is that? So we did pretty well on that first stage, but I'm not going to spoil it yet. You're going to have to watch the next episode to see how we did during the whole rally, but I can already tell you it was quite the adventure. <laughs> <laughs>